Hi friends, uh, here is another problem of arithmetic progression related to the sum of n terms. Question is saying here yes, so that uh, a1, comma a2, comma dash dash dash, uh, comma an dash 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 form an arithmetic progression. AP stands for arithmetic progression where an is defined as below. An is or the so nth term is equals to 3 plus 4n and in second case nth term is equals to n minus 5n. Now in both cases we have to also find the sum of the first 15 terms in each case, right? So uh, in this problem first we have to show an AP after showing the arithmetic progression we have to find the sum of the first 15 terms, right? So let me write the first uh, first case uh, that is a n is equals to 3 plus 4 n. So uh, when n equals to 1 we'll get the first term a1 equals to 3 plus 4 times 1 that is 3 plus 4 equals to 7 and again when n equals to 2 we'll get the second term that is 3 plus 4 times 2 that is 3 plus 4 times 2 that is 8 8 plus 3 that is 11 again when n equals to 3 8 3 will be equals to 3 plus 4 times 3 that is 3 plus 4 3 is at 12 12 plus 3 that is 15 right and again let me find n4 when I will put n4 I will get the fourth term that will be 3 plus 4 times 4 equals to 3 plus 16 equals to 19 right so uh, and so on right so what we got uh, let me write here right uh, exactly our series has been here uh, sorry sequence has been 7 first term 11 second term 15 fourth term 33rd term and 19 fourth term and so on like this right so whether it is an arithmetic progression or not first we have to check it out that right so let me find the common difference here between this and this 11 and 7 so 11 minus 7 equals to uh, uh, now 7 5 right uh, not exactly 4 4 so 11 minus 7 equals to 4 and if I will subtract 19 minus 15 then again it will be 4 right and if I will subtract 11 from the 15 then also I will get 4 so everywhere the uh, difference is 4 so since the difference is constant I can say this is an arithmetic progression right so now I have to find the sum of the n terms of the 15th terms right first 15 so it means first 15 right and is here 9 uh, 15 and first term is here 7 as we have got this now I have to find the sum of the 15th term right and sum of the 15th term uh, for this formula the sum of n terms is n upon 2 right 2a plus n minus 1 times the common difference right so as 15 is equals to now 15 upon 2 times 2 times a, a is the first term that is 7 here again n plus n minus 1 n is here total 15 minus 1 times the common difference the common difference here is 4 right again 15 upon 2 2 7 of 14 right 15 minus 1 again 14 times the 4 right so again 15 divided by 2 uh, it will be and see here in both cases uh, here is 14 and 14 so 14 comes outside so 1 remains here and this 4 will be here so 2 7 right so now it is 15 times 7 times 5 right so again uh, 5 15 uh, 15 uh, 15 5 just 75 times 7 right so 75 7 just 7 5 just 35 carry over 3 7 7 are 49 49 plus 3 52 right so 5 to 5 so we got the first sum of the first 15 terms as a 525 for the first case right now in second case also exactly we have to do the, do the same thing as we have done over here right and I hope you'll be doing this and uh, try to solve this problem right it's exactly the same as I have proceeded right so do follow these steps as I have done and you'll be getting the uh, solution of this uh, of this part right so this is uh, let me 
read once again this is a n equals to n minus 5 n right put the value of n 1 2 3 4 5 6 respectively right up to 3 to 4 forms uh, 3 to 4 terms up to 4 times uh, you must have to find up to 4 terms right uh, then after that just uh, put the value of uh, all the things in the sum of n terms formula and you'll be getting the value right only you have to find up to 15 we'll be meeting in the next video with a different type of problem okay bye bye